Hello, and welcome to the peaceful district of Wakanok. A place of serenity and holy sacrifice. I'm your host, that guy from that one movie. No one saw. And in this short documentary, we'll be highlighting some of the places you're bound to find in this bountiful wasteland. Also, you might be wondering why there is snow in a post-apocalyptic nuclear warfare rage world. That's an excellent question. Moving on. Up first, we have the peaceful city of Waknuk, a farm town with a bunch of other stuff going on. Up first, we have an interview with one of the economic leaders, Joseph Storm. So Joseph, how are you doing this fine day? Well, let me first start off, praise this wonderful day. And to answer your question, I I've been okay. This morning I had uh, to deal with a sheep that had a uh, bladder disorder. And now I'm off to uh, take care of a, uh, another mutation. Would you like to join me? Oh, it's very interesting. Yes, we, we would love to watch you come sacrifice this poor defenseless animal. Well, thanks. Come along. <laughs> Okay, so here we have our mutation. This is a cow. Clearly it does not look like a cow. It has no spots, long tail, and is very small. And extremely fast. So, we must take care of her. Fascinating. So now, the sacrificial song. Kumbaya, my lord. Kumbaya. Oh, 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 oh crikey, I got it, I got crikey. It. The, um, the, the cow thing seems to, um, be well, away. That's walking up, folks. That's, uh, that's too bad. All right. Uh, we've got a real treat for you today, guys and girls. We, the, as in the inspector and his assistant, Pablo, have agreed to take us on a burning run of the local mutated crops. Let's listen and watch. Now, as you can see here, folks, this plant here, it looks like the norm. But tis not. It is immune. Why else would it be growing in the winter? Hello? So my assistant Pablo will now help me light it with this new substance called Axe. Let's watch. And now... <laughs> Kumbaya, my lord. Kumbaya. Crikey, this wild country sure is crazy. Thank you, Inspector. And now let's head off to the fringes. So here we are with Mr. Billy here. Mr. Billy is a fringes man and we're going to be interviewing him here. So, what can you tell us about life out here? It sucks. Why does it suck? Because the food is scarce, there's no water, but luckily we have raiding parties that get us food and water and it can last us for weeks on end. Alright, so why did you get banished out here in the first place? I'm a mutant and I defy God's image. And how did you defy God's image in the first place? I have a birthmark. A birthmark? Where? On my neck and it's red. Oh, I don't suppose you'd let the viewers see that. Sure. Oh god mate, that, that's disgusting. No, no wonder you're out here. Yeah. Jesus. Alright. So anyways, uh, does anyone else live out here? Well, my group has been getting a pretty hard time from this woman, woman tribe and they've been like trying to catch us or something for slaves. I guess they just want like big strong men for slaves and everything. I, I see. <laughs> Is that one of them now? Yeah. Um, oh, oh, jeez. All right. Well, um. <laughs> oh, damn. That, he was supposed to be on the raiding party this week. So, are you part of the raiding parties? Nah, I just sit around and, you know, knit sweaters from Nutrigrain bars. It's pretty fun. Yeah. All right. Well. <laughs> All right. Thanks, mate. Um, this has been real insightful. And uh, have a happy mutated slave life. Now we're going to go to the last part of the Wakanuk district, the Badlands, a place so vile, you're probably going to die of radiation. Hello, I'm this guy. I'm filling in for that guy. 
because he kind of stubbed his toe. But don't worry, he'll be here for the last segment of the documentary. Now, we're here in the Badlands, and we're here to interview the Lone Wanderer. We don't really know who he is, but he, did, he appeared in a video game a few years back. So, uh, what do you do out here? Yeah, I mostly just shoot stuff, look for my father. He's kind of dead, but I still look. Ah, and uh, what's it like out here? Well, you, you can't go too far without getting radiated and stuff. I lost a few fingers in my time. Um, yeah, so um, basically this all started when, you know, everyone's just like, oh, we got a bunch of nukes, let's nuke everybody, ooh, do 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 Or as the people in Wakanak like to call it, God's Tribulation. And uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Ah. So, uh, oh, duck, super mutant. I got it. Don't worry. Oh, well. Hopefully we'll see you again when the um, real narrator is back. I'm this guy. See you later, folks. So that's walking up for you, folks. We hope you've enjoyed this short documentary on this peaceful wasteland city. Tune in next time as we go to Pallet Town to see some Pokemon. Wait, hold on. What's this then? It's it that mutated cow from earlier! Why does I wrestle this beastie with my bare hands? Ah! Oh, ah! Oh, ah! Oh, crikey, she's a big one! Ah! Oh. Oh. I'm your host, that guy, from that one movie. <laughs> hit, it, hit it again. Hit it again, Pablo. Okay, let's start over. <laughs> all, all over it, Pablo. All over it. Many, many, I'll get more. Lubricated up, Pablo. <laughs> okay. Okay. And now, we burn. <laughs> <It's green. laughs> <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> the berries. This Jesus time. Christ, guys! I so that's walking on for you, folks. I'm back, and I hope you've enjoyed this short documentary. And wait, hold on. What's that? Damn it, man! Praise this wonderful day.